artificial intelligence, AI coins, AI stocks, or ChatGPT. We're seeing it everywhere. But most of the people don't really understand what AI actually is. Even though AI is a rapid growing field that's changing the way we live, work, and interact with technology. In simple words, at its core, AI is the development of computer systems that can perform tasks that normally require human intelligence, such as visual perception, speech recognition, decision-making, and language translation. But AI is a very vast industry, and if you want to learn everything about it, make sure you subscribe to our channel, AI Tech Academy, to keep getting our AI and tech-related videos. And do like the video if you like the content. Now, without any further delay, let's delve into what is artificial intelligence. To understand AI, it's important to know the difference between the two types of AI systems, which is narrow or weak AI and general or strong AI. Narrow AI is designed to perform specific tasks and cannot think or learn beyond those tasks. For example, a narrow AI system might be designed to play chess and it will only play chess and nothing else. On the other hand, general AI, also known as strong AI, can think and learn like a human being and can solve any problem a human being can solve. Currently, narrow AI is much more common than general, as the latter is still in its infancy. But how can we understand any software without learning its history? So let's see what we've got here. The history of AI can be traced back to the 1950s, when researchers first started exploring the idea of creating intelligent machines. However, it wasn't until the advent of modern computing power and advancements in data analysis that AI began to see significant progress. Today, AI is being used in a variety of industries, from healthcare to finance, and is having a major impact on our daily lives. So, how does AI work? Building an AI system is a meticulous process that involves reverse engineering human traits and capabilities in a machine and then using its computational prowess to outperform what we're capable of. To comprehend how artificial intelligence works, one must first delve into the various subdomains of artificial intelligence and comprehend how those domains can be applied to various fields of industry. The first concept to grasp is machine learning. As ML trains a machine to make inferences and decisions based on prior experience, it recognizes patterns and analyzes previous data to infer the meaning of these data points to reach a possible conclusion without relying on human experience. This automation to reach conclusions by analyzing data saves businesses time and helps them make better decisions. Then there's deep learning, which is an ML technique. It teaches a machine how to process inputs through layers to classify, infer, and predict the outcome. The third and most important of these is neural networks. These neural networks operate on the same principles as human neurons. They consist of a set of algorithms that capture the relationship between various underlying variables and process the data in the same way that the human brain does. Natural language processing is another science of a machine reading, understanding, and interpreting a language. When a machine understands what the user is trying to say, it responds appropriately. Computer vision algorithms come in second last place on the list because they attempt to understand an image by breaking it down and studying different parts of the object. This assists the machine in classifying and learning from a set of images to make a better output decision based on previous observations. Finally comes cognitive computing algorithms, which attempt to mimic the human brain by analyzing text, speech, images, objects in the same way that humans do and attempting to produce the desired output. Now that you guys are clear on the question of how AI works, then let's move on to what the hype is all about. Where AI can be used and is it already in use? Let's find out. So for the time being, the goal of artificial intelligence is shared by all of the various tools and techniques that we've invented over the last thousand years to simplify human effort and assist us in making better decisions. Artificial intelligence has also been dubbed our final invention, a creation that would create groundbreaking tools and services that would exponentially change how we live our lives, hopefully eradicating conflict, inequality, and human suffering. That is all in the distant future, and we're still a long way from such outcomes. Artificial intelligence is currently used primarily by businesses to improve process efficiencies, automate resource-intensive tasks, and make business predictions based on hard data rather than gut feelings. As with all previous technologies, the cost of research and development must be subsidized by corporations and government agencies before it is available to the general public. Furthermore, AI is used in a variety of domains to provide insights into user behavior and make data-driven recommendations. 
Google's predictive search algorithm, for example, used past user data to predict what a user would type in the search bar. And Netflix uses previous user data to recommend what movie a user might want to see next, hooking the user and increasing watch time. Furthermore, Facebook uses past user data to automatically suggest tags for your friends based on facial features in their images. As a result, we can say that AI is used almost everywhere by large organizations to make the lives of end users easier. The application of artificial intelligence would broadly fall under the category of data processing, which would include searching within data and optimizing the search to return the most relevant results, as well as logic chains for if-then reasoning, which can be used to execute a string of commands based on parameters. Now, finally, let's see which industries need AI the most and how AI will revolutionize them and help them prosper. First and foremost, the healthcare industry is one of the biggest beneficiaries of AI. AI has the potential to revolutionize the way we diagnose, treat, and prevent diseases. AI algorithms can process large amounts of medical data and provide doctors with insights and recommendations for personalized treatments. This can lead to earlier diagnosis, more effective treatments, and improve patient outcomes. Another industry that is greatly impacted by AI is the financial sector. AI is changing the way banks and other financial institutions operate by reducing manual processes, detecting fraud and improving risk management. AI algorithms can process large amounts of data and provide insights into market trends and customer behavior, helping financial institutions make better decisions. Manufacturing is yet another industry that is being transformed by AI. AI algorithms can optimize production processes, reduce waste, and improve efficiency. AI can also help manufacturers better understand their customers' needs and preferences, allowing them to develop products that meet those needs more efficiently. The retail industry is also a big player in the AI revolution. AI algorithms can be used to analyze customer data and make personalized recommendations, improving the customer experience and driving sales. AI-powered chatbots and virtual assistants can also be used to provide customers with quick and efficient support, reducing wait times and improving customer satisfaction. In conclusion, AI has the potential to revolutionize a wide range of industries, from healthcare to finance, manufacturing and retail. It can help businesses make better decisions, improve efficiency and deliver better products and services to customers. If you're looking to start or grow a business, considering incorporating AI into your operations could be the key to your success. So, that's the end of the video. Now, if you have any questions related to anything we've explained, then do mention that below in the comment box. Now, if you found the content helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel, AI Tech Academy, for weekly content just like this. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.